don't do it don't try to work under stress it will not help you you keep forgetting in exams hall let me tell you hey guys welcome and welcome back to my channel my name is sandra if you're new here hello welcome and if you're returning thank you so much for coming back i hope by the end of this video anyone that has not subscribed you'll find a very good reason to stay with me i am a final year medical student in russia i made a video sharing some advice for freshers coming to russia right and then i saw that a lot of people enjoy that video so i decided to make let's say a part two version of it if you haven't seen that video i'll try to link it in the description box maybe you can check it but today's video is a short one short and sweet i know i'm going to title it maybe i will title it things i wish i knew in my first year or things i wish i started doing rather yes things i wish i started doing in my first year right from first year right yeah so let's just get right into it okay, so the very first thing that i wrote down is try to find um study buddies right or a study buddy try to have a group study i'm not going to explain things a lot i feel like this is self-explanatory i feel like when you study with people you are able to remember things more right and you still learn things that you're not able to cover when you are studying on your own i'm not trying to say don't study on your own of course you will have to study on your own but try to have a regular discussion with people who also want to know their materials want to make it you know in medical school I, it will go a long way to help you if you start right from the beginning the second thing that i wrote down is don't entertain a very close relationship with someone who doesn't like to study or people who don't like to study people who don't want to put in any effort at all it will go a long way to affect you i'm serious even the bible talks about it the bad company corrupt corrupt good character right now this is not like i don't know i don't know i don't want to say it's bad company but basically you want to study you want to make it in medical school right so if you can if you really can try to avoid surrounding yourself with a lot of people who don't like studying people who don't want to put in effort for nothing people that um don't see the point of studying during the semester all those stuff try to you know not be so close to such people because let me tell you if you have like about five people around you like that trust me you will become the sixth person no matter how much you like to study you will become the sixth person so try as much as possible to surround yourself with people who like to study or basically don't just have a very very close relationship with a lot of people who don't like to study the next thing that i wrote down is study on your own go get your own materials to study let me tell you um these schools the lectures that they give us and all is just not enough right fine it will help you to pass in class to help you to pass during exams and all those stuff but for you to have a proper knowledge for you to be the proper medical student that you want to be learn this from me i wish i knew these things or i wish i started doing these things right from my first year i feel like i would have had a really really better experience in russia so go out there try to communicate with people back home try to go online find materials on your own there are a lot of groups that you can get a lot of help from there are these channels channels group you know a lot of things even on telegram on a lot of social media platforms at least me i know for telegram on facebook too there are places like that like on telegram there is this channel called it starts with a k i think it's kaplan kaplan i don't know i will post it somewhere but there is a channel like that there are channels that uh people like group themselves to study try to get involved in this stuff right from the start right it will go a long way to motivate you to keep you like it will keep you motivated so that you always want to study yes get materials from all those places get materials from the internet get materials from people who are back home people who are in different places you know get materials from them and try as much as possible to go through it try as much as possible to study those stuff too apart from the lectures that you you will be learning here the materials that your school will provide you right yeah the next thing that i wrote down is go home for practicals if you're coming to russia to study 
please go home for practicals if it's within your means you know each every summer you have the option to either stay here and spend your holidays or go back home you know and spend your holidays if i was to do this again this medical school again i would really try as much as possible to always always go back home and try to get involved in the practical aspect of medicine. I don't know about other universities, but, but for my university, I don't really see the quality practicals that we have, you know. We don't have that much practical. So if I were you and my university is also like that, I would always, like every year or at least every two years, you know, try to go home and get involved, get myself acquainted with the practical aspect of medicine it will go a long way to help you you understand stuff a lot more thank me later mm -hmm. so guys if you have been enjoying this please make sure you hit the subscribe button make sure you give this video a thumbs up so that it is going to be shown to other people who are also interested in studying in russia right so let's jump to the next point try to ask your teachers or the doctors that teach you right <laughs> try to ask them if you can assist wherever that they work if they are surgeons if they are whatever try to ask them make effort you know i feel like some of us maybe if we had put a little more effort to ask the teachers like can i come with you can i come and just watch you while you do your stuff i'm sure those teachers would have allowed us but we just didn't ask you know so try to ask your teachers if you can come around and assist them and all that you know my next point is learn russian language guys learn russian language on your own like try to learn russian language whether you're in english medium you're in french medium whether you're in russian medium try to learn russian on your own it will help you a lot as i said i have explained over and over again people still come into my dm to ask me i have said it clearly for my university whether you're in English medium or you're in French medium or you're in Russian medium, there will come a time that you will need the Russian language, right? So if you learn it on your own, it's, a, it's just a bonus to you. It will help you a lot, you know. So try to learn Russian. You can learn Russian on YouTube. YouTube is like, YouTube can teach you a whole lot. And if you check my short, right, I try so hard to post videos about like russian language um you can just check those things i don't really post russian language that i am the one teaching you right i i post other people's short content and you can follow all these people and try to learn more russian my right? next point that is like try to make russian friends <laughs> russian is more every language i think it's more about practice the more you practice the more you get better the more you practice the more you you know how to use certain words right and russian is one of it so try to make friends who are russians for me right now i don't even i can't i don't even know if i have a russian friend like i can't even see someone that will say okay this is my russian friend i really don't know like i have people i know but i don't know if anyone is like my friend you know just try whatever <laughs> try to make russian friends try to get people um and a place that you can actually meet people and practice your russian is vk vk is a whole world on its own like <laughs> if i start talking about vk it's crazy but that's the place that you can meet russians you can meet a lot of russians practice your russian as much as you can as much as you want another place to actually meet people and maybe like make um friends for life is all these apps so there is this app where you can meet new people whether you want to date you want to whatever just basically my point here is try to meet new people and these kind of apps can help you maybe you are, you are not there i'm not saying go and get go there to date people no just go there to meet new people meet new people make friends russian friends so that you know you can practice your russian more because even them sometimes they are looking for black people so that they can practice their english so if you can make a friend like that it's like a win-win i i i sometimes we speak english sometimes we speak russian it will help um the two of you guys i'm tired like my next <laughs> and i think this will be my last i said this video is going to be short so my last point is start preparing for exams early <laughs> 
students i feel like we like working under stress which is so bad it's so bad so bad start preparing for your exams very early like a lot of times we have the questions for the exam even like right from the beginning of the semester so if we can try if you can try because me i'm fine with you like i'm done <laughs> If you can try to solve those exams question try to prepare for those exam question right like i don't know like maybe at the beginning of the semester or like way way before the exam time even comes so that you have time to like go over it so that you know you will be able to remember stuff you know it will help you a lot like for real to help you a whole lot don't do it don't try to work under stress it will not help you you keep forgetting in exams hall let me tell you also this place I've, i think i've explained in one of my videos i don't remember which one but i've explained how our exam system is russia it's in the form of billet billet is like you pick a paper right so if you pick a paper now like you don't know which questions you are picking you will just pick a paper now and you see like three or four questions the three or four questions they are part of whatever you learned during the semester so like the three or four questions they are not covering every single thing that you have learned it's just some specific things and if you don't remember those specific things you are doomed like that's it <laughs> so yeah try to prepare for exams early you need it you need this advice let me tell you you need this advice let me tell you i'm doing you some good you should we should go ahead and subscribe to my channel and make sure that you watch my ads because the girl needs some money <laughs> all right guys that's all for this video make sure you give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe bye 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 so i just created a group on telegram and um, the name is study in russia i just created it so that you know people or people who are interested in studying in russia who have a lot of questions will just meet there and you can meet people who have the same interests as you people who are coming to russia people who are in russia you can talk with anyone there you can meet friends you can you can like ask for um help in terms of material study materials and we can help one another i mean you can help each other <laughs> i'm fine with you guys <laughs> it's a space where i feel like if it can help you i will link it in the description box try to join you know and yeah that's it bye guys